stage one entry burn has started. And stage one entry burn shut down. And as you just heard and saw, we had successful startup and shutdown of the re-entry burn, the second of three burns in the phase to get back to landing zone one. Now the third and final one, as it is self-named, is the landing burn. This one lasts a little bit longer. It's about 17 seconds in duration. It's coming up in about 30 seconds. We should, get pretty good, we should get pretty good footage of it coming down from the top of the screen. And again, that's a 17 second burn. So the legs deploy and we touch down on the surface of landing zone one here in this attempt. Stage one is transonic. Stage one landing burn has started. have deployed. Falcon has landed. Now, it was dark, but we saw some great ocular reflection as the heat and the light from the engine reflected off of landing zone one, so you could see it as it deployed its legs and touched down. Now, with the transition from the successful deployment of the payload fairings and the landing of the secondary mission, that first stage, we'll now conclude our coverage of this Zuma mission. We'd like to thank our customer, Northrop Grumman. We'd like to thank the United States Air Force and the Cape Canaveral Air Force Station range for all of their support in every single mission. We would additionally like to thank the Federal Aviation Administration for their part in regulating and licensing every single one of these launches. We would also like to thank you, the viewer, for tuning in as always. If you are interested in learning more about what we do here, please visit our website, SpaceX.com. And if you're interested in joining our force, SpaceX.com slash careers. Please look for updates on all of our social media channels. We're going to post updates regarding the upcoming missions. Thanks again for joining us, and we'll see you next time.